Plan to keep black bears at bay. A central Florida neighborhood is switching to log top trash cans to deter the wild animals. Dave McDaniel spoke to neighbors in Seminole County about the program. House by house, delivery of all new bear resistant garbage cans. When bears have easy access to trash, they were walking through in the daytime, they were walking through at night. Matt Warner didn't have to see much of that before he invested in a bear resistant can. And I noticed almost immediately that they were no longer coming into our neighborhood. For the people in the neighborhood already using the cans, they say the beauty of them is this the bears can shake them around, they can try to bite at them, but this requires your finger in there before it'll ever open. Bears can't pull it off biting right into it, just trying to bite into it, You're biting into the steel. Thanks to the Humane Society of the United States and the folks with Wakaiba Wild and Scenic River, now all of his neighbors will have the hard to open can. Responsible trash management is key to reducing human bear conflicts. Seminole County passed a bear and trash ordinance just over a year ago after a handful of injuries to people from bears. Uh, we have not had one, not one in the uh, year and a half that this uh, program has been instituted. He says bear calls from Seminole County to the state have dropped 50% since trash is harder to get. They're going to stick, you know, to that routine and that's normally staying in the woods and staying away from humans. Well, according to Florida Fish and Wildlife, there's approximately 4,000 black bears in the state.